Um, what was the best part about returning to this world for you two? Being together, I think. You know, yeah. Like, like having the, the opportunity to work with each other again, because we are, without doubt, we're a very, very close bunch. Not just not just the actors, but to work with Danny, you know, again, is, is, is always a, a treat. And also, um, beyond that, there was a, loads of people on, on the crew who were back again, who'd worked on, on the first film. So it was, it was fantastic to see all them again, you know, and so it was, a, it was a whole massive, massive family thing. Family reunion it was. It was, it was lovely. Yeah, the film been really special for all of us, you know, as youths. And this time around, uh, we, we did not take it for granted at all. Every day felt precious. Every day felt like a day that we were, were not going to get back. And uh, just, I think, we really appreciated coming to work every morning. Um, I think it's because you said before, some interviews today is absolutely right that we, we you kind of took the first one for granted, you know, mm -hmm. because it, it was to us at the time, you know, without it's not meaning to sound blase in any way, but it was kind of a another film. It was just something that was a great film. It was a fantastic piece. We knew it was an interesting thing to do, mm -hmm. but we had no idea, of course, that it was going to take off in the way that it did, and it was going to have the kind of, you know, the. Um, the kind of reverberation throughout the world that it had. It's, it's, it was incredible, really. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I loved it. So, uh, do you ever watch the original, re-watch the original? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. No, no. I, I mean, personally, I don't use, like, you know, I, I, when I see something, I watch it once, maybe twice. Mm -hmm. And that's it, you know, I mean, I don't, I really, mm -hmm. I really, really don't. And it always kind of fascinates me, like, one of, one of my, my, my best friend, in fact, you know, he, he has seen Trainspotting maybe 50 times, you know. And I just can't, can't go over that. And I, I'm sure he's not alone, you know. I'm sure people watch it over and over and over again, you know. Mm -hmm. But uh, I, I can't really do it. It's very difficult to be objective, you know. I mean, it's, 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 it's a different thing for us, I think. Mm -hmm. yeah. mm -hmm. we, we, we know what happens behind the curtain. So yeah. it's hard for us to... Um, mm. to just appreciate it as, a, as an audience member. Yeah. I mean, it has so many different associations. You know what what we were doing that day, or the joke that he just made, or the, you know, we, there's, there's so many things that that kind of block us from being able to appreciate it, you know, as, as we'd like to, I think. Yeah, yeah. Having said that, with other films, mm -hmm. I've watched other films that I'm not in, Many times, yes, countless yeah, times, yeah, you know. Yeah. But it's it's just yeah. it's, it's your own face sometimes. Like, oh. mm -hmm. <laughs> I can't even listen to my voice when I'm answering. Um, <coughs> so, uh, how was working with Danny Boyd again? And has he changed? You think in the twenty years since you worked with him? It's just an absolute treat to work with Danny Boyle at any time at all. He's, he's a wonderful. I've been fortunate enough. I've made quite a few things with Danny now. Um, has he changed? I think, yes, I think he, he probably has. I mean, he's, he's like we are, he's 20 years older. His, uh, his filmmaking technique has uh, certainly has polished through the years. I could see that. And um, he's more, he's always been kind of, kind of technical, you know, he, mm -hmm. he knows, but he, he wants different, sort of different, a kind of different outlook on, on filmmaking. Certainly was in the first film, but even more so. In this one, I mean, the cameras that he was using, and you know, with Anthony, mm -hmm. the fantastic, John Mantle. Yeah. wonderful DOP we had. Yeah, I mean, they, they, they are to me, Danny and Anthony, are like the Lennon and McCartney of our age. Yeah, you yeah. Know, they're the real visionary team <coughs> who, who like are expanding the cinematic landscape, yeah. and uh, and they're using technology in ways that, um, I mean, most a lot of the cameras in this film that Anthony was using were prototype cameras. They hadn't been. Mm -hmm. They hadn't been used before on films. Mm -hmm. Some of them were tiny. We think uh, yeah. that you you know you wouldn't see he's got something in his hand, but you know, normally movie cameras are you know big big giant things with huge lenses on them. And the thing they they normally hate, uh, I mean, he's a DOP cameraman as well. Is it's been handheld because it's it's heavy. These mm -hmm. things are heavy. Mm -hmm. But this thing that he was using it was the size of an iPhone, yeah. tiny, yeah. Yeah. tiny wee thing like that, walking about handheld. Mm -hmm. and, yeah, so they, they, they're pushing, they're always pushing uh, in a subversive, in a wonderfully subversive kind of way, you know, uh, a way to uh, frame, compose this this shot, you know, the room. You know. I remember we were doing uh, the, <coughs> the running sequences, <coughs> myself and you and McGregor chasing them through the, through the town, which you come and see the film, you will see. Uh, and it was uh, it's very difficult because we were, it had to be night time. And try to get night time in, in Scotland in the summer is, is mm -hmm. you know, it's a premium, you know what I mean? You don't really get an awful lot of it, you get a couple of hours. And I, I was thinking, well, this is going to be an early night tonight. 
And Danny said, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, you're kidding. This new camera that he's using. And he's seen on the monitor. I was like, where's the light going? It was dark again. You know, oh. and he's, uh, it was just fantastic to, to kind of see how much he enjoyed that and the pleasure that Danny took in, in the filmmaking mm -hmm. process. That's good. That's it. That. Thank you. So the next <laughs> one you do, you can just work all night. 24 hours a day. Let me That's the problem.